Welcome to Crafts by KMW. Today I have a really quick, helpful tip video for you because I ran into this issue just the other day and I came up with a quick solution that I would love to share with everybody else who colors in hardcover books. So I have Hannah Carlson's Spirit Animals, which I have been coloring in. And I have colored about 10 different pages. And yesterday, I just so happened to turn the book over for some reason. And I noticed that the back cover was getting really, really dirty. And so I was really distressed about this. You pay a lot for hardcover coloring books. So you wanna keep them really nice looking. So after about 20 minutes of erasing with regular erasers and the gum erasers and wiping it off with paper towel and water, I finally got the back cover clean and I thought I need to cover this in some way so it doesn't continue to get dirty. I clean the surface of my craft table all the time, but stuff still gets on it. So this was my solution. So I covered the cover with wax paper. So what I did was I covered the front cover first and I just ripped off a piece of wax paper and the size that I needed. I folded over the side and then I folded over the top and bottom and taped them to the um, paper that was already there. So there's no adhesive or anything inside my actual book. Then I went to the back cover, did the same thing, but I kept this one a little larger. So fold it over the flap, fold it over the top and bottom, tape them. And then this one came over and overlapped the first piece on the cover and I taped that down so the cover will stay in place. And now I don't have to worry about my cover getting dirty anymore. So that's it. If you have any other ideas about covering your book, you can use lots of things. You could use paper, craft paper, book covers, um, even fabric, but I wanted to see the cover. So that's why I used wax paper, but there's lots of other options that you can do to keep your cover clean and undamaged until you finish coloring it. So if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe. I would love it if you would do that. It really helps me out and it helps me to know what kind of content that you are looking for. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and take care.